Singapore's reputation as a clean and organized city is over 200 years in the making and began with Singapore's first British resident and commandant of Singapore, William Farquhar. After Farquhar arrived in 1819, he got straight to work, organizing the port town. He forbade littering to prevent the outbreak of diseases. He cleared jungle, drained swamp, and laid roads. He ordered the Rocha River to be dredged. This, together with Singapore's deep water harbor, laid the foundations for Keppel Harbor and trade near the Bugis village. He also put defense structures in place to protect the harbor. But this developing colony was not without its share of challenges. Farquhar faced them head on with ingenuity and pragmatism. For example, early Singapore was infested with rats and centipedes. He solved the problem by getting the locals involved. The promise of reward money resulted in a speedy resolution. Munshi Abdullah, Stanford Raffles secretary and interpreter wrote, Finally, the uproar and the campaign against the rats in Singapore came to an end, the infestation having completely subsided. Farquhar was also insistent on fire safety measures, amongst other things. And this proved crucial to Singapore's early success. Farquhar's legacy remains part of the modern city-state.